On this video, we will show you how to install and activate Eventica WordPress team. So we will start with an existing website. First, you need to download Eventica from your Themeforest download page. After that, you can unzip that file. You will see this structure. So basically, we provide you documentation, parent theme, child theme, and dummy data. To install Eventica WordPress theme, you can go to your WordPress dashboard, go to Appearance, Themes, and then click Add New. Click Upload Theme. So first, we need to upload the Eventica parent theme first. I will click Install Now. Okay, but do not activate this theme. Click Return to Themes page. And now click Add New again. And now Upload Theme. And now you can upload the Eventica Child Theme. Click Install now. Okay, I will click Return to Themes page. So, Basically, you will have two themes here, Eventica Parent and Eventica Child. Okay, what you need to do is you need to activate the Eventica Child theme. I will click Activate. Done. And then after that, you can refresh your website again okay it's all good right and then you will see this notification so basically we show you that we have some recommended plugins that you can use with the eventica wordpress themes you can click this link and then you can try to install all of them in one go if it's okay or you can install it one by one so for this example I will just install all of them I will click this one oh sorry okay so now let's uh, install and activate all of the required plugin okay it's done now i will click to return to dashboard okay now uh, don't forget usually after installing new theme i will always go to the settings permalinks and then i will click save change just to make sure that everything works and then also you can regenerate your thumbnail i will go to tools regenerate thumbnails and then I will regenerate all thumbnails to make sure everything is good. I have a 65 uh, image now so you can wait the process but right now it's already good except the this is this one for the home page you still see a, a big image here different size so that's why you need to regenerate your thumbnail okay once it's finish you can try to refresh this page again okay so now it looks good done thank you very much